for new home sales, they rebounded just a bit here in September, up just about 12%. You see that full number there on your screen, 759,000 in the month of September. Taking a look at some of these numbers here, that was up from a revised 676,000 the prior month. This is according to the latest numbers that we're getting out from the Commerce Department. Now, we know that this number is seasonally adjusted, and it also just explains just the number of homes built out over an entire year and if builders continue or, or are going to continue to build at that very same pace. So taking a look at these numbers that we're getting, U.S. new home sales rebounding just a bit last month in September, up 12.3 percent, Brad. Yeah, 759,000 for a seen, uh, seasonally adjusted annual rate that we saw come through. And I, I think ultimately here for the 12.3 percent that we mentioned, uh, that is uh, above the revised August 2023 estimate of 676,000. So we got a revision there on that August number as well here. Um, but ultimately, I think for where the sales are going forward, where they're taking place, it's still an environment where in the rates that people are being able to take on and ultimately having to figure out what the calculus is in order to not just purchase a new home, but then what that financing looks like long term, that pricing is going to come uh, into play as well. The, the sales price, the median sales price of new houses sold during September, $418,800. Um, the average sales price, though, that came in at $503,000. $900. Hey, we talk about the fact limited supply continuing to push up uh, prices that people are paying across the country. Now this rise in new home sales follows an 8.2% decline that we saw in August.